Amen. It's the ISO guy, Sensei, the greatest name on 2K in existence. And look, do not skip this video or are you going to be wasting your bread. Pay attention to what I'm saying unless you want to waste $100 on your build. I am going to be giving you the best meta lockdown in NBA 2K25 for all modes. Multiple lockdowns. I'm going to be explaining why they are crazy OD. You can finish. You can stand and dunk. You have elite shooting to where you're going to be able to unlock T-Mac when you do eventually get to unlock it okay you're going to have elite shooting people are struggling to shoot you know you got a little bit of playmaking you could pass and you got elite defense and you got a badge that most lockdowns are not going to have and you have it as your ruby okay these are the best lockdowns so yeah y'all make sure y'all subscribe we're gonna keep you up to date with the builds y'all let me know what other builds y'all need help with so you don't waste your bread now if y'all get this video to a thousand likes i'll show you some gameplay on this build okay now look we're gonna make him a shooting guard six six 235 71 wingspan okay that's close shot is gonna go up to 74 look i know guys a lot of y'all are very casual you don't understand that 2k makes it to where certain attributes have to go up okay, you got a 48 layup you ain't gonna be laying up with this build bro don't be spazzing you know what let's start at the bottom so firstly 74 vertical okay you'll be able to unlock special type of blocks all this and that and look at this 92 strength okay you are going to unlock enormous movable enforcer y'all will see later on agility we're gonna be making 85 okay it's gonna help you unlock a lot of badge right speed is gonna be at 83 now you know i know it's kind of you know it's probably not as high as you want but with how i made this build it's it's perfectly fine the perimeter d is od the agility is great the speed it's 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 good enough this is a very slow game you should be perfectly fine to be honest this is a very very slow 2k now look the block is a 78 okay you're gonna you're gonna unlock high flying denier okay now look your steel this is what you're gonna have to use your cap breakers on, right? So you get gold glove, you're gonna use your cap breakers to at least get it to 96, right? To get it on Hall of Fame. You could do it even more if you want, you know, the legend and all this and that, but you're gonna have to use at least two cap breakers to get it on Hall of Fame. People are saying on ball stills ain't like that, but this is good enough steel, right? Now your perimeter D is 97. Now look, this is crazy, right? You got purple challenger, purple on ball menace, purple pick dodger, Ruby, a movable enforcer. This badge is going to help. There is no bullying. There is no, the, the movement is cooked. With this badge, you're going to be able to do that. Feel me? You you feel what I'm saying? This is why, like, the speed, you know, some people probably go in 85 or a little, maybe more. But with this, it's it's done, dog. And then when you get your steel, oh, purple. Right? You know, like, it's cooked. It's cook. I wish I could have got rebound, but I can't. They upgrade the play mag making automatic. So you're going to be able to get a little wiggly. Man, you might even be able to take this build to the 1v1. Man, I ain't going hold. Like once you figure out some of the speed glitches, you already got elite defense. And this, bro, it's 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 done, bro. So look, you're going to have a 70 free throw. You, know, you can use this on all modes, y'all. Now your three-pointer is going to be a 79. Okay, y'all saying, oh, low, low. But look at this. This is where you really want them one right 89 midi okay you're gonna be a fade god from the midi it's gonna help you unlock other badges it's gonna make shooting much easier now look you get set shot specialist y'all know that's catch and shoot that's a bunch of shooting badges now combined into this badge it's gonna make you being a spotter much easier and you're gonna unlock t-mac later on unless they made it way higher last year it was 87 so you're gonna already have that. So you're gonna have this gold and then the best jump shot in the game as a lockdown. It's OD, I mean, it's unpatchable. Okay, you get a little bit of standing dunks and then we're gonna go 55 driving dunk for a great dunk package that I like. And the 45 standing dunk for a good dunk package that I like. And this is the build, bro. I personally think this is the best lockdown overall that you can really make. Now, I'm going to show you a 6-7 version, but this, the 6-6, six, six, this, I believe this one is better. Okay, you get more attributes, all that. More more badges, better badges. And yeah, so here's what the build name is called. Hey, look, Derek White, <laughs> Alex Caruso. You, you finna spend $100 to make an Alex Caruso. Look at that. I know a lot of y'all are going to hate. My build's way, way more well-rounded. Look, this is a build for team. Like, team. This is why a lot of y'all... Y'all, y'all are casuals. You don't understand. In your all-around build, you can't completely stop someone because you don't have a movable enforcer on Ruby, right? 
So if you have a team or if you just play fives or anything, you could dominate this even with random. Who doesn't need a lockdown? Come on, it's elite. You're just not gonna be able to do the little crazy scoring. And even, you you can even score. You got an 89 midi. All you gotta do is catch the ball, go fake. You're Gucci. Then you can hit wide open shots and you play an elite D. You can play everything, but this is built behind having a team. But yeah, I don't really like the name too much. Two way catch and shoot threat. Um, let me know if that's a W to you, if this is common. But look, now I'm gonna give y'all the six, seven version. I don't like this version because you don't really get purple pick dodger. But if y'all want to be bigger for some reason, here you go, man. 228 weight, 71 wingspan. Gonna knock it down to 40 layup, 57 post control. Okay, bring this up to 89. Knock this down to 66. Hey, you see, we already got the playmaking, the defense, the rebounding. We're gonna bring the speed up to 85. So you're a little faster. You get slippery off ball on gold. Now look, you don't get pick dodger on purple with this version. Bring that strength up to 92, okay? So you still get a movable enforcer. You get brick wall on gold. This is pretty broken. You'll be able to set screens with your lockdown. This game's gonna be completely broken when people start doing this, and they're gonna exploit the game real bad. And look, we're gonna bring the free throw to 67. That That is the, that's the 6-7 version, you see? Let's see what this bill name say. Alex Caruso, Derek White. Christy. The way catch and shoot threat. Now look, the reason I think that 6-6 six, six lockdown, especially that I showed you, is pretty unpatchable because you got standing dunks at a decent level. I wish I could have went higher with it. And you got a nice dunk package that is similar to the quick drops, okay? With the driving dunk. The mid is stupid high. So you should be able to be cash, especially compared to like your counterparts on the game. Okay. And you definitely need pass accuracy. God, never make any builds without no pass accuracy. I know you might even see comp guys do it or spread it, especially in the stage they do that. Guys, it's horrible. You need at least the pass accuracy I had. I went there, so we got a little break starter, if anything, even though we're not rebounding. But it, it's just a benchmark, right? You got to have some pass accuracy because you blow so many free scores. And in fives, you just ruin it. I know in threes, you can go up to your guy and hand him the ball and let him go crazy, but that's dumb. You should just be able to pass the ball, let the game play faster. You're less predictable. If someone's easy, it's right under the rim, you could give it to him. Or if he decks and you got the ball, and you could give him. But if you got some 25 pass act, you are ruining the game for everyone. Might, you might not be able to tell, but there's so many things that happen to where a pass act matter. You can't have it on 25. You have to have brain cells. Please start telling people this. That 25 pass act is cooked. Now the interior D, I wish I could have went higher, but I couldn't. It's a decent interior D. You got a little bit of block to help you out too. So you Gucci. The main point of this build is to play on ball D, D and shoot the ball at a very high clip, okay? You already got the perimeter like that. When you get your first cap breakers, by the way, a lot of y'all, you're only gonna be able to get five cap breakers in the cycle of the game. So don't think you're gonna be able to get 10 or 15. A lot of, you know, unless you some crazy sweat. Your first five cap breakers, you can use them, you know, to unlock that Hall of Fame steal. You put the rest on the perimeter to really make it get funky. And yeah, like you, you pretty good. This is like a, this is a meta lockdown that you're going to see 2K League guys type of make that make. It's not going to be as good as mine because I'm smarter than everyone. And it's going to be like comp stage guys or comp park guys. They're going to make lockdowns like this. Okay. You might have some different type of lock that can, uh, crazy driving dunk but this is the one you know you got the agility you got the the vertical like you good that strength especially if they make strength matter more they make uh strength matter for lockdowns now because you get different type of badges last year a movable enforcer was a very op badge it was like a clamps and you bump people you real strong so it's like you're you're gonna cause a lot of problems you know, do do your homework, do the knowledge. Now, now it's Ruby. Come on, man. You you got a damn near 99 strength lockdown. Come on, bro. It's it's cooked. And then if you are running into the problems with gold glove, even though I heard all on ball stills are nerfed, you can use that max plus one badge perk to get it purple until you get your cat breaker, you know. Yeah. And then if anything, if you're struggling with shooting, you can make that set shooter purple. Hey, sauce. Now y'all click on the video on the screen if you want to see all. That's gonna happen with the incoming patch for NBA 2K25 video on the screen. But hey, hey, here we go again. Yeah. Here, here we go again. People talking this, but when this hit the fan, everything I'm at made me. Now break it down. Yo, off the top of the dome, dome.